Yes. Okay. 27. <laughs> Yeah, she's 25. How old am I really? Really? Probably really, really. Better. Whatever, you know. Hey guys, it's a new day. It's my birthday. Today I am 27. Now I'm 35. Uh, I feel 27. That's the average age people think I am. I'm working today. I'm happy to be somewhere I like to be uh, and enjoy being daily going out tonight for a party um, there's gonna be a live band there will be dancing there will be birthday shots and there will be fun to be had by all um, hopefully my friends can make it and I will slip some footage in um, from tonight's festivities so oh, so many things I've learned in 35 years um, to start out I've learned that there are so many things that we worry about that are unnecessary and um, we don't really get very far from worrying about them. I'm, I'm beginning to learn how to just chill and not make things happen, not force things, and just to enjoy life, just to enjoy what comes my way. Um, I've learned that loving people and accepting people without judgment is crucial to be happy with um, life and yourself in general. Uh, the harder you are on other people, uh, it's usually a sign of how critical you are of yourself. So um, stop judging yourself, stop judging other people, choose love. Jealousy, judgment, they all come hate, all come from gaps of um, things in your own life, you know, insecurities. So um, take hold of those things and just enjoy life. Just choose love, choose happiness, and things will begin to, good things will gravitate towards you. So I have learned that age is a number, that weight is a number, that successes are just a number, that goals met are a number, and that numbers really don't matter when it comes down to it, that what really matters is the experiences, you know, what you take from life, what you learn, how you grow, what you experience, you know, and just being in awe and in wonder of what life has to offer. Um, I was able to travel a little bit in the last um, couple of years and it's kind of ignited a passion for more of that. I knew I wanted to travel before that, but like getting to see neat places like the Dominican Republic and I just fell in love with the people there and you know, Colorado being in the mountains and close to nature and the water, the rapids, oh my gosh, like amazing. Um, Florida, the ocean, oh my God, like so many great places. Um, I'll be going to England um, soon. I'm going to be going to Texas in a couple of weeks and then Nashville, Tennessee. Um, so that's all in the next month and a half. So it's going to be busy, but so much fun. I'm so thankful that I'm able to do these things and that I have um, wonderful people and great friends around me to do these things with. So um, one of my bucket list things that I'm checking off this year is to see Beyonce. girls trip we're driving to Nashville to see her I can't wait I can't wait and um, so yeah Bye -bye. a few things you may not know about me I am one of four children I am the middle child but also have tendencies of the oldest child so um, you know I am Native American my whole family is dark complected, uh, dark eyes, dark hair, and then there's me. I have a hard time tanning. It's not right. It's not fair. 
Um, I do have the high cheekbones, though. That's my claim to fame. Um, and the dark eyes. So, yeah. Uh -huh. I guess I got my dad's German side uh, as far as the coloring. Um, when I was 14, 15, I was part of an equestrian drill team. When I was in sixth grade, I lived in New Orleans, Louisiana, and made the district honor choir team, and um, just went to, with the with my best friend because she wanted to do it, and I ended up trying out and made it. I uh, had a great experience, learned a lot. I'm highly allergic to cats, and my sister has one. You do the math. <laughs> I can flip my eyelids inside out. I won't do it because it's gross, but I used to do it in grade school and I would get sent to the principal's office all the time. I had fun. Um, let's see. I got in a lot of fights when I was in school, usually for taking up for the underdog, so it was all like, you know, justified in my mind, but I did get in a lot of fights, so it was pretty feisty. And, um, yeah. I played volleyball and basketball. Um, I ran track. I was very fast. I was a good sprinter. I wasn't built for long distance. I remember running a long distance um, race and there was a shed that I hid behind for like two minutes just to catch my breath. <laughs> um, yeah. I don't know what else. I'm not that interesting. Um, I just, I love life. I love people and um, I just have fun being surrounded by people that laugh, that can make me laugh and that I can make laugh. You know, laughs are contagious. Laughs are my favorite. They're my favorite. Definitely my favorite. So I hope you're having a great day today. And um, if you'd like to stay tuned as to where my life heads um, at the ripe age of 35, um, please subscribe, share, like this video. Um, thanks for hanging in there with me. I love you guys. Talk to you soon.